We shouldn't be trying to come up with the perfect diet. Oh, we should all be vegan. Oh, we should all be paleo. Oh, we should be all high fat. It really is individual. You really want to find out what works for you and how you feel, what happens to your metabolism, what happens to your energy, what happens to your digestion, what happens to your other health issues. There's a one-year multi-center trial, a randomized study, which is hard to do in nutrition, but they did. It was published in the New England Journal of Medicine. 63 obese men and women, they were randomly assigned either a low-carb, high-protein, high-fat diet or a low-cal, high-carb, low-fat, conventional diet. So one was not restricted in calories. One was. The one that was restricted in calories, they didn't do as well, right? The low carbohydrate group actually lost more weight, had lower levels of triglycerides, cholesterol, blood pressure, and blood sugar. They just ate more fat and less starchy carbs. Now, not everybody responds the same way. We're all a bit different. For example, I know I need more carbohydrates. So I have to eat sweet potatoes, healthy carbohydrates, but have a little more starch because otherwise I will lose too much weight. I probably shouldn't say that, but I will. <laughs> we want to actually make sure we are eating fewer starchy and refined carbohydrates but based on whole foods, we can adjust our diet to be higher in fat or lower in fat or higher in carbs or lower in carbs. Your scale and your lab test will help you know what's best. It's important that you track what's going on. What works for somebody else might not work for you. You have to figure out what works for you and how to personalize your, your approach to what you're eating.